Hey y'all, welcome to my vlog called Wind Down with Rand and I am jumping right in with another vlog called Home Alone Top 10. We have something at work we do in which we re-watch old movies together as a group and I recommend it for us to watch Home Alone. Home Alone is a classic and was always one of my favorite Christmas movies to watch. Listen, re-watching movies as an adult, it hits differently. Here's my top 10 things I noticed while watching Home Alone in no particular order. My top 10 thoughts, whatever. Number one, Kevin had a long day and really needed a hug at the beginning of the movie from his mom. Number two, the family needed better controls to ensure a child or no one was left on the family trip. Instead of calling numbers, call everyone by their name. Number three, what did Kevin's uncle, Rob McAllister, do for a living to afford to pay for so many people to travel internationally for the holidays? Number four, Uncle Book did not read the room when a mom when a mom noticed she forgot Kevin at home. His response was, well, I forgot my glasses. Shaking my head, not the same thing. Number five, the price of pizza aged well. 10 pieces at $12 each. However, the rest of the stuff he purchased at the store would cost like $75 today, and I believe it was only about $20 in a movie. Why did Kevin, oh, number six. <laughs> Why did Kevin have access to a gun, even if it was a BB gun? Number seven. It is interesting watching them walk straight to their gate in the airport. No security check or anything. Number eight. Kevin's mom had her address book to call her neighbors. I can't remember the last time I've seen an address book. Number nine, sometimes you think you're afraid of things until you have to boss up like Kevin and face the things you're afraid of. Number 10, the scene with his neighbor at the church was my favorite scene. So often the older generation is forgotten and they have so many beautiful stories and wisdom to share with others. Those are the things I noticed or my comments while I was re-watching a movie on last week. Looking back on this movie, there were a lot of movies I watched as a child, which would not be acceptable for kids to watch today. What is your favorite holiday movie? So we are exactly one week away from Christmas, which is crazy. This week has flown by. Thank you so much for watching my different vlogs over this year. Thank you for your support. Please like, share, comment, share this with someone else and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And like always, ciao and happy holidays.